guys, I hope you're all doing well and welcome to a new video on my channel. Before I'm going to start off with this video, I quickly wanted to say I'm so sorry for my voice. I sound so congested and that's actually because I am I'm very sick at the moment. I just didn't want to let you guys down because this video is going to be a summer clothing and swimwear haul and I know a lot of these things sell out so quickly so I just wanted to upload this video as soon as possible so you're able to still purchase any of the items if you like them and they're not already sold out because I know how annoying that can be so if I don't sound or seem like myself I'm sorry it's just because I'm a little bit ill so this is a video in collaboration with Zaful all the items that I'm going to show you are from Zaful and Zaful is one of those Asian web shops that it's really hit or miss. Everything is very cheap and some items also look very cheap and other items are actually very nice quality. If you for example watched my how to style floral video you know that one of my favorite bomber jackets is actually from Zafu. So I actually have some pieces that are really in my capsule wardrobe if that makes sense that are from Zafu and very affordable and the other items are not that nice. So I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. I have some great clothing pieces and swimwear pieces in this haul and some that are not so great um, so yeah don't worry about integrity I'm always completely 100% honest with you guys because I see you as my friends honestly I love talking to you on snapchat and on Instagram I always try to respond and if I don't respond I at least try to read it so yeah I see everything that you send me I'm going to start off with swimwear and the first swimsuit that I'm going to show you is this one and I adore this print. I am completely obsessed with this print. I think it's so tropical and summery. Um, it is a high-waisted or a high-rise um, swimsuit which means that it cuts you a little bit higher on your hips which I find very flattering. Um, it has a little bit of a deep V but it's not too deep and then the back is also a little bit open. I'm not sure if you can see it but it has some clouds on the side as well and the best thing is that it has padding and I am a type of person that doesn't really like it when things are showing through if that makes sense so I always prefer a little bit of padding and this has padding which is great but you can also remove it by the way so the next swimsuit is a little bit of a miss for me and that's because this swimsuit doesn't have any padding so it's completely um, yeah it's completely see-through if you don't mind that, it doesn't really matter, but I do. Um, so it has this mesh panel in the front and then it has an open back and also some mesh detailing here. But yeah, this just didn't really fit me, it wasn't really flattering, so I would not recommend this swimsuit. The last one piece that I wanted to show you, I also have some bikinis after this, is this very simple black uh, one piece with a zipper detailing which is kind of sexy but you can you know you can unzip it a bit like I did here or you can close it completely or do it completely open whatever you like um, but it's just a black uh, swimsuit it's not as high rise as the leaf um, one piece that I showed you but it's a little bit high rise it's still very flattering and the best part about the swimsuit is the back so I have this problem with open backs that they sometimes create a gap on my sides and it's really weird um, but this one doesn't do that because of the strap in the middle so that's very very nice and again it also has padding i'm definitely going to rock this swimsuit when i'm going to greece i'm going to mykonos and santorini and to marseille with my best friends can't wait to be in this instead of like i don't know wintry clothes i'm wearing a play suit by the way from zafu as well but it's way too cold to wear this outside but i just like turned up the heating so it looks a little bit spring and summerish but so now I also have a bikini to show you so this is a very um, nice bikini again it's padded and this is the top and uh, it's in this very nice kind of emerald green color I think this color is a color that looks good on any skin tone and what I like about this swimsuit is that it has the scallop detailing which is such a trend for swimwear right now and um, it's like one shoulder it's like um, asymmetrical I think it's called yeah it's kind of an asymmetrical top and I think that's just so nice it's also double lined so it's very thick then it also comes with this high-waisted bottom with again uh, this kind of detailing this is very high-waisted it's a true high-waisted bikini I love that I think it's super flattering I prefer high-waisted everything 
over not high waisted anything, if that makes sense. So the last bikini that I wanted to show you is again with scallop detailing, but this one is black and it's just a simple halter top. And if you're not very blessed in this poop area, something like this is the most flattering shape that you can go for. Honestly, I feel like all other shapes kind of make you look like you are super flat and this gives you like a little bit of cleavage but not too much and it's just very simple and easy and the bottoms are also scalloped and black and they're double lined and um, they're not really high waisted they're kind of mid uh, rise I would say but I still am going to wear this together because I still think it looks cute so I feel like I've gone through all the swimwear super fast uh, hopefully you like that because I always feel like I ramble so much in my videos um, but now I'm also going to show you the clothing and everything is behind me um, so I also got some summer clothing pieces not that much this time because I also got a lot of uh, swimwear um, so let's start with the first piece it's this uh, white or maybe even a little bit off white I'm not sure I think it's like real white uh, bandeau crop top and this, you guys, is so flattering on. Um, it's one size and it does fit a little bit like small. Um, it has a zipper in the back, which makes it a little bit easier to put on. But yeah, I think like a small medium can fit in this, but that's it. I'm like an XS slash S. So yeah, if you're bigger than that, it's going to be tricky. But if you are my size, this is such a nice top because it gives you like the most flattering um, neckline and cleavage situation and it's just a great alternative if you want something that's a little bit more sexy and feminine than just a white tee. If you kind of know my style, you know that I wear a lot of white tees with a leather jacket over it or something like that and to spice things up or to go out, something like this is perfect. So the next piece is a piece I wasn't really sure about and that's why I still have the tag on it and that is this off-shoulder crochet lace top and although it's very pretty and I love tops like this in the spring and in the summer I have no idea how to wear this because it is completely see-through, it is not lined and I thought it would be lined and I can't put a cami underneath it because it is off-shoulder and a nude bra is just too much in my opinion. I don't know, like the bandeau tops, I don't know, I don't have those. I don't really like to wear those. So I am not sure how to wear this. If you have like a good uh, way to actually wear this, let me know in the comments down below because you would help me out a lot. And yeah, it's not that the quality is better or something, but I just don't know how to wear this to be honest because it's just too see-through to wear on its own. Speaking of something that does have lining and is so stunning, oh my god you guys, is this dress. Honestly, this is one of those pieces that you would never expect to find for such a cheap price at one of those Asian web shops. This looks like something that you can find at Dolce & Cabana or Dior because it's like the same style. It has the white crochet detailing but then it has nude lining which makes it a little bit more sexy in my opinion. And it is very long, like it's a midi dress on me it's almost a maxi dress because I'm so small but I like it and then it also has adjustable straps which is perfect and yeah I just think this dress is perfect if you have like a summer dinner or like summer wedding something like this is so beautiful and so stunning if you're new to my channel hi I'm Lydia and I always wear play suits in the summer because they're super flattering and super easy and they make you look put together and yeah, I'm wearing a play suit right now, um, but I also thought let's order some new ones to add to my collection. Fortunately, I didn't like this one. Um, the print is very nice because I have quite a minimal style, like I don't really like very busy prints, although I know this is kind of a busy print, but I, I just couldn't wear this because it was just too see-through, like my whole bra was hanging out, it was just way too deep. Also, the bottom didn't really fit me that well, um, it was too tight and the straps were too long. This play suit was made so weird, I would definitely not recommend this. I can't imagine a body shape that would look good in this anyway, so yeah, this is definitely a miss. And last but not least, I want to end this video on a positive note, because I did find another play suit to add to my collection, and that is this super pretty kind of dark nude 
floral kimono play suit. Oh my god, you guys, this is so cute. I just love wearing something like this together with some nude booties or some nude pumps and then with my Gucci Dionysus bag. This looks just so cute. It also comes with like an extra tie you can tie around your waist or you can also use it as a choker which is a little do-it-yourself tip for me. So yeah, this is definitely a great piece. The material is also very lightweight and nice, so I would definitely recommend this play suit if you want something that's a little bit more toned down to add to your collection. So that's the end of this summer haul and I hope you enjoyed it. Again, I'm so sorry that I'm sick, but there was just no way I could wait and recover and still be on time with this video. So I hope you still appreciate the effort. Also, I just quickly wanted to thank you guys for all your support. Like, recently I've been getting like so many kind and sweet messages and yeah, it just, I don't know, it really makes me feel so much better because I'm kind of heading into a more difficult, um, like, period of my life. I'm moving to DC, to Washington DC, and like leaving my life behind here is quite difficult and uh, like I'm leaving behind my family, my friends, everything is also super expensive over there so yeah it's definitely kind of, I don't know, kind of made me very anxious but having this kind of stable factor of YouTube and you guys still caring about my videos and saying sweet things to me really makes me feel better and kind of more at peace or at home hopefully if I'm in DC so again thank you so much for your support because it really means a lot to me I can't imagine like all the effort and time you put into writing me messages it's just it's just amazing so thank you guys yeah if you are not part of the family please do and hit that subscribe button down below you can also hit the notification bell if you want to get a, like a push notification every time that I upload a video um, also let me know in the comments down below which item was your favorite so I don't have anything else to say have a fucking amazing day and I'll talk to you later I hope you're all doing well and welcome to a new fashion video on my channel. So if you have followed my channel for a while, you probably have